longboard just chilling out in my room i bought it at five below for 25 bucks and uh yeah no it's been skated a couple times but uh yeah i think tonight i'm gonna take it out for its final final cruise around town and uh yeah other than that um i don't see this board really having too much use in my little fleet that i've accumulated here but uh yeah um it would it would just take a lot of absurd upgrading especially for this board and it definitely would just not be a very practical decision to upgrade this board and yeah just not very cost effective especially when most longboard parts go well beyond 25 bucks i think the cheapest would be bearings which unless you have just a bunch of parts like i do lying around then there's no point in upgrading this but uh even if you do have parts they're probably better going on a more expensive longboard but on that let's get to skating and see how it goes you say never let me go
Alright guys, so this board has served us good and definitely has been real fun to just go rip around on and kind of abuse, use and abuse. But uh, yeah, so um, yeah, this marks the end of the $25 longboard. So other than that, I think this is the time for a perfectly fit ending. So other than that, let's get to it. So yep, end of the $25 longboard. Other than that, like, comment, follow, and subscribe, and see you guys next video.